Yeah, so I wanted to do a quick review of these two guys here. This is the Use Mini Shaver Travel Shaver. This is the uh, Xiaomi S600 Travel Shaver. Now, these guys are both really small um, rotary shavers, you know, for your face. And, you know, they're a lot smaller than something like this, which is a, like a Philips Norelco, a regular size shaver. And yeah, and I think one of the most interesting things about both of these is they charge via USB-C. So you don't need to bring any funny chargers, you can just bring, you know, your regular charger that are used for your phone or for your headphones or whatever. Um, with that said, I've used both of these for about a week or so. I'm going on a trip in a little bit and I'm definitely taking this one. And I'll tell you what. So. More or less, these are pretty similar. You know, you push the button, it turns on, and you, know, you have this cap here. Push the button turns on. They have two rotating blades. Um, you can take the blades off for cleaning, and you know, put it back on. This one, this one's magnetic actually, which is kind of nice. Yeah, and they're pretty sharp. They're not that powerful compared to you know a full size shaver like this but they get the job done. Now there's one key difference that makes this guy though, the Xiaomi, way better than this one. Um, and that's the ability for the, the blades to tilt. Um, and this makes it way easier to get on the contours of your face. So you can imagine if this is like your cheek or something. You know, you, it, it actually like conforms to the shape of your face. This guy has a little bit of articulation you now here, but nowhere near enough. And so if you're using this, like let's say this is your face, you're really only using one of the blades and it takes so long to get a good shave out of this. So yeah, if you're using this, the you know, articulating blades help it really contour your face a lot better. You get a much cleaner shave and it's a lot faster. This guy, because there's a limited articulation on the blades, you're basically using like just one of the two. Like the, if you're using one, the other one doesn't really quite, quite get there. And so it takes way longer to get a good shave. And so yeah, I think overall like this is way better. This is much closer to a traditional shaver. So yeah, that's a quick review of these guys. I highly recommend this one. I don't really recommend this one. I'm gonna return this. All right, so pros, cons. We're looking at these two. Pros of this one, very nice build quality. This is stainless steel, super hefty in the hand. Uh, has this really nice case that you can put it in. Um, yeah. And it's also small, it's very compact. Uh, the other pro of this one is that it runs for about 50 bucks on Amazon. And that means you can return it. It has a US warranty, all of that good stuff. Uh, you can buy replacement blades on Amazon. Actually, I'm not sure if they're on sale yet. But anyway, the company sells on Amazon, so it's easy to get. Cons are mostly, yeah, it's about the blades. It doesn't articulate enough, and it's really hard to get a good shave. Um, the other con is that it's really hard to remove the blades for cleaning. Like there's, I don't, I think you have to like really you know, pop that off to get it to work. Um, pros of this guy, um, articulating blades, one, hands down the best feature of this one. Uh, the other big pro I think is this cap, you know, you can put it on and then this guy becomes a self-contained unit. You don't have to have this fiddly um, leather thing. Uh, cons, there isn't, this case is not very good. This, you know, this squishy leather-ish half case. And it's big, it's fat. Um, and the last con is, it's also about 50 bucks, but this isn't sold in the US, it isn't sold on Amazon. And so if you want replacement parts, if you want warranty support, you gotta go on AliExpress, which is not the best website in the world. Um, well, it takes a long time to get here and everything, but yeah, of the two though, this is the better one. Thanks for watching. Yeah. See y'all in the next one. Happy travels.